so hello my friends welcome back to my channel i hope you're doing fine and that you had a really wonderful christmas so this is my second video of the week i hope you're ready i hope you liked it i hope you like the lookbook part of it of course and uh, if you haven't yet please subscribe it's free full of fashion adventure and me and only me i do fashion i love fashion and i do it i do give fashion advice twice a week I love it. I do have Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook, as well as my fully available website, which is 3 It print shop is going to be right here, and everything is going to be linked in the description box below, as usual. I do have my first digital lookbook magazine, which is fully available for everybody, free, on my blog port. So there is a link. I'm gonna link it in the description box below as usual as well. It's really a lot of like really good things. I mean, we pass Christmas now, but it's still really good for getting ideas for outfits, even for New Year's Eve because this is like New Year's Eve almost. So. Um, this is gonna be other outfits for that kind of event so please check it out there's a lot of good things and my second digital lookbook is gonna come up on January 1st hopefully but I'm working on it I really really love it and all I can say now is gonna be like a special winter essentials plus jackets which is like my favorite at the moment so it's gonna be a little bit something uh, related to it so stay tuned it's gonna be a lot of fun and if you like my first digital lookbook you're gonna love it as well it's gonna be even more fun I like, can you believe it and uh, by the way little disclaimer here if you do hear noise coming from my apartment it's not my apartment it's like the tracks really downstairs on the street that actually getting rid of the snow so there's a lot a lot of snow yeah like I said probably gonna hear it anyways but I'm really sorry about it supposed to just like pass by I think they're done by now I really hope so anywho this was another lookbook I miss doing lookbook it was just over a week where I was just like talking again and again it definitely didn't have a specific thing to it because it was most styles that I loved the most and it was mostly like glam rock, glam shade and we are closer to New Year's Eve so I think they're gonna be it's gonna be a little bit of like outfits that could give you an idea it's gonna be in the, in the description box below so let's get started my first outfit was uh, really nice stop well they all are nice it was this uh, nice white leg pants from H&M really thick like I hold it and it's like really heavy as you can see the details here the button details which I like the most and they are so trendy at the moment to the 80 90s kind of vibe because of the shape and because of the details here it has that kind of vintagey yet modern look that um it was definitely definitely something that was nice to have so originally $69.99 Canadian dollars and I decided to pair it with this really nice stuff from H&M as well you've seen some styles like that in my previous lookbooks when I had my frangy jacket from Zara which you're gonna see it again here again so I love the fringes I love the movement to it I, I really love the style of it pretty much pair it with anything you can think of because just the top gives you that kind of really nice standing out look I guess of the fringes you have a really nice visual appeal again and that's what you're looking for right so love the movement I love the love it and to add a little bit more like edgy to it I paired it with my classic blazer well <laughs> leather jacket from H&M as well but just because of the different texture and the really nice gold detail of the pants I thought it was a really nice idea last thing that I paired with was my nice bag from Zara it was just the idea here to just add a little bit more color to it because it was all black so you can pretty much be good with any color that you can pair it with 
so I decided to go with this really nice bag and again it gives you that sophisticated really sophisticated look actually my second outfit was with this really nice skirt from forever 21 and as you can see there's a really nice like I don't know how you call it but uh, they are super nice and they actually are oh no we can remove them I've showed you that one in one of my videos but that was another look that I loved I'm in love with this skirt I can pair it with anything and that's the beauty of it so I wear that with this really nice oops pair it with this nice top with these sleeves that I love you know, the shift with is definitely nice uh, to even add a little bit like edginess to it I had my fishnet tights as usual <laughs> I miss them so much together was really simple really kind of really diff even add a little bit more leather to it because I love leather that much I put it with this nice leather jacket from Vero Moda that I bought a couple of months ago weeks ago no, actually a couple of months ago not everybody is gonna like the style, not everybody is gonna like the whole outfit, but I think it defines me so much more compared to some other outfits that I'm gonna show to you here. But it was one of my favorite because it's so much me. So much me. Now my third outfit, which is my favorite after the uh, the one that I showed you just me, favorite by by far. <laughs> it's this really nice jumper from Zara. I think it's amazing, it's just gorgeous. I definitely love this jumper, love it so much. I just got it, I think I got it last week, but um, what I did is that instead of keeping it, I went back to Zara and I got it discounted because it was a boxing day. So it was originally $69.99 and I got it at $39.99 Canadian dollars. The quality of it, the like the print, Everything is really good here. Uh, I had to actually ha add a belt to it because it's so loose on me. I'm being lost in the freaking whole, the whole material. I put it with my really nice full food jacket from Dynamite that I bought a couple of years ago. I think I bought it at least two years ago. It's trendy now, like full food is on the go. It's everywhere, you see it everywhere. And I love the combination of these two together. I really love it. Guys, pink dark pink color with like some kind of like green details to it I should call this video green vibe because everything that I had like every outfit that I had it was that kind of like green accent to it I really should it I should call it like the green green yeah green accent green vibe type of video look for this yeah <laughs> I was just getting excited I definitely love this though I think they're amazing together so let me know what you think about it because it was my favorite one I could wear this jumpsuit like every freaking day because it's cute sexy without being too much and that's what I like that's what I say all the time I love it when it's sexy cute yet a little bit not too much revealing you know you know what I'm saying yeah it's it's, it's that okay <laughs> last outfit was the this really nice skirt again from Forever 21 paired with this nice stuff from Zara that I bought a couple of weeks if not months ago I love the color I think it was really nice to actually pair it with that because it was all black and this was that had kind of like grey accents to it which was really good with the with the skirt just to add more color to it without being too much color. It's mustard but because of the grey accent, grey black accent to it, they were not fighting it against each other. Yeah, this is gonna be hard. <laughs> to add a little bit more drama to it, I brought it while my third layer was the jacket from Zara that you know so much now. No need to say more. I think everything was a little bit more edgy, a little bit more edgy shake. Not everybody cup of tea to be honest. I need again my fishnet tight sweat. So it could be a bit more match for some people and it could be just not the style at all for some people. My style definitely is much more like glam rock and glam chic than anything else. So this is really this was really the video where I was like showing you 
what I would wear in a regular day if I'm not going to work, of course, because it was, yeah. If I'm not going to work, I would actually dress up like that. Okay, this is the end here. I will see you guys next week and be on the lookout because my digital magazine is going to be out for the first of January. A lot of fun. It's going to be free again. So everything is going to be link linked in the description box below. And um, what else I was going to say? Another lookbook next week because I kind of like bought some a couple of stuff from like Boxing Day. So uh, should be here next week, hopefully, crossing fingers. But um, be ready for this hope it's gonna be ready for the first of January and for 2018. I will see you guys next year. Can you believe it? So yeah. <laughs> if you have any idea of what kind of video you want me to do, let me know. I'm gonna be more than glad to actually acknowledge it and do it if it's all good. So let me know. Bye. Have a really nice weekend and uh, see you next year.